Hey, what up Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? Welcome to my Fallout 76 Atom Shop and Daily Challenges uh, notification video. In this video, I'll cover the Atomic Shop on the offers that are about to end within the next 24 hours, and we'll also cover the Daily Challenges uh, once we're done with the Atomic Shop. And today, for the super duper, the most easiest challenges from the Atomic Shop, uh, there's only one. And it's to drink 10 alcohol drinks and you'll get 10 atoms. The rest we'll cover after once we're done with the atomic shop. So let's not waste some time and jump right in. Alright, so let's navigate to the atomic shop. And today we got an outfit. <laughs> and I'm actually gonna get it because I did receive one comment in the past uh, from a New Zealand member about this outfit, but I never had it, so was not able to make a review. Plus, uh, it was requested to show on a female. I was gonna look on the female character as well. So, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna buy it right now, and I'm gonna show you how it looks on the male character and on the female character. So, Let's go and craft this thing, shall we? So in order, whenever you acquire atomic shop items, of course you need to go to the, your armor workbench. Then since this is an outfit, we navigate to the outfit section. And there we go. So to make this, we need five cloth. And, oh nice, the sun is coming up, so beautiful. Alright, afterwards, oh, I had the duper thingy on. There we go, bam. So that's how it looks. Uh, let's get oh, in this location here. Like that. Bam. Alright. It looks good. I like it. It will really, I think, look nice with a black cowboy hat and a blue bandana. Uh huh. Alright, if you don't know where to get the cowboy hat, uh, the black one. The quickest one is in the White Springs Golf Club. If you go on the sort of basement floor or whatever, first floor, there's going to be uh, a skeleton sitting on a wheelchair, and exactly on the wheelchair, you find the black cowboy hat. Uh, the blue bandana spawn, uh, I think it's right here. There is a ship over there. You jump on the ship, and you look around the ship, and you'll find it. Or just look it up in my uh, playlist where I show you the 100% guaranteed location to find outfits. <laughs> Alright, so let's take a look how this is going to look like on the female character. Alright, and here is how the outfit is going to look on the female character. Actually, it also really looks, uh, really looks nice with that stalker bandana. Uh, I would still prefer the black cowboy hat. This is the Atomic Shop version of the hat. Um, so they said the black cowboy hat is way better than the Atomic Shop version. But overall, I mean, this is the outfit, and I think it looks good on both characters. Alright, so, by the way, if you haven't locked into the game yesterday, make sure to visit the Atomic Shop. There is a free, really good-looking wallpaper for your walls, so make sure to claim that one while it's free, because <laughs> usually they charge 500 atoms for that. Alright, and now let's take a look on the actual challenges, dailies, so as I said, the most easiest one from them all would be to consume alcoholic drinks, right, whatever, whiskey, vodka, beer, and so on. Uh, you can get them from the train station, or from your travels, or make them at your camp, whichever comes here. Uh, I had mine. <laughs> okay, then, uh, back on the beat. I was mistaken, this event actually starts here in Morgantown and I do give a big love and thank you to Z-Clan for correcting me in uh, one of the videos where I mentioned that that event starts somewhere here. Actually it's not, it starts in Morgantown and uh, it's where you have to protect this robot rules. Uh, after and Also you'll need to wear the full set of the police uniform, right? the cop uniform, the cop hat, that you can obtain in Mothman. I've already shown the location a couple of times, I don't have a spawn point with this character, but anyway, just look it up on my one of the videos and you will see both locations. And uh, they are 100% guaranteed, by the way. Alright, next, challenges. Kill fireflies? Man, 
I gotta freaking note it down. I, I know you guys tell me a lot of places where to get those. I tried to look it up, I couldn't find it, so I'm gonna dedicate, and I think I'm gonna start making a different playlist, like a uh, dedicated per sort of event, so I won't have to be like re-recording and talking these over all over all over again, since they are pretty much all over the same, right? So just make a new playlist of all the dailies and weeklies that we get to do, and uh, sort of I'll be able to show them around. I think that's gonna be the most easiest way uh, Plus one video dedicated to specific event probably if someone doesn't know to do something in specific uh, We'll be able to look it up and bam bam done So uh, kill a legendary enemy at the fissure site the only way it is possible to do is to Well, there are a lot of fissure sites over here And if you're lucky enough to find a legendary scorched beast, you'll be able to complete that challenge in no problem uh challenges daily okay so level up if you level up and you complete three of the following sub challenges you will get additional 10 atoms and that is level up while 76 level 76 or higher morgantown airport while under level 20 wearing sunglasses illusion uniform and hat level up in white springs uh fissure site uh, by the legend, uh, legendary, <laughs> by the walk, uh, the mutant trader, the traveling trader, which is, I mean, I've seen him five times since beta, so pretty much impossible to do. While yielding a sword, using camps, uh, engage in PvP in your camp or your teammates' camp. So if you complete any of the sub three sub, uh, sub challenges for this challenge, you will obtain an additional 10 atoms. Kill four players in the nuclear winter, and you will get a set of perk cards or a perk, perk card, whatever. I don't do nuclear winter, but I'm actually thinking of starting playing that nuclear winter. So, uh, have I completed it all? Yes. Check, 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 check. The only thing, quick Firefly is the only place where I've managed to complete this quest is whenever the event starts at the Landview Lighthouse. It's called the Path to Lightman, if I'm not mistaken, where you kind of kill those things. Uh, pick up, fire it up with the fuel, and then Mothman appears. You engage with the Mothman, you'll get some uh, bonus XP from the Mothman for an hour or two, and I think it's five percent. So, if you see it popping, go and get it. <laughs> and I believe, ladies and gentlemen, that's it. So. I hope you enjoyed the video and if you did you know the drill don't forget to leave that like comment down below and remember please do not use profanity in the comments as those comments are not visible to other users I disapprove those comments so what I mean by that is that I can read them but I can't react to them because they're on hold so I delete them I have that in mind do not promote third-party websites and sell guns caps services wherever for real money that is something I do not support so if you're to mention company names or try to sell something for real cash, you're gonna get banned, so don't do it. And uh, if you're new to subscribe, welcome to Z Clan. I'm Gamer Z Saul. I hope you enjoyed the show. And if you want to help my channel grow, please do consider sharing this video somewhere in the media, such as Facebook or Twitter or any other social media platform, or recommend me to a friend. By the way, I'm from Ukraine, so I'm from Ukraine, and I'll see you on today's live stream. But yeah, today is live stream, <laughs> and uh, or the next video upload. So, okay. Wow. Z Clan, everybody else, you have a good morning, day, and night, whatever you guys located at, and I'll see you on the next video. By the way, don't forget to hit the bell so you don't miss out on live streams or videos. Bye now.